All right, people, welcome back. More Daily Duels. So today is Friday. That means now we are playing Chemical Beast. Chemical Beast. So this would be interesting. Uh, this one was probably the hardest of all the, the five decks to make because Chemical Beasts just don't seem that strong. Like, they really don't. They really seem like they're kind of a little bit lackluster. So hopefully we can do some plays. Uh, you're seeing some interesting cards right here. You're seeing Malefic Stardust. I have an idea for that. I have an idea. So I was actually working on the deck, and I'm like, God, this field spell is really important. You know, I'm going to keep it on the field. So... I have an idea. Let me go ahead and use my field spell and just keep banishing my fucking chemical beast while my Malefic Stardust gets the damage in. That was my idea. And I think and overall, I think it's a pretty good idea. I'm actually just gonna go ahead and take the neck. I'm actually gonna go ahead and take the neck. Usually I wouldn't. Usually I wouldn't. But my plays that I'm gonna do are pretty major. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, that's fine. Uh, so we'll go ahead and play that terraforming, get my field spell and all that. So you're probably looking at Tyler, you're like, why is it called Midnight? <sighs> I have a to story to tell you. And uh, actually, it's do with school. Uh, sorry, I apologize. There's still no girl stories. I know you guys love those, but I haven't really been talking to any ladies lately. Like, I'm not gonna lie, I have not flirted or talked to any girls like that in a cool minute. At, at least say in like a year, actually. I think the last girl that I was talking to and trying to get to know and you know, you know, possibly going out with was I remember. I remember that I was texting her on my 21st birthday. Because I remember her texting me and saying, happy birthday, 21st birthday. I'm now 22. So it, 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 it's been a while. It's been a while. So we're going to go ahead and use our Chemical Beast effect. We can send a Chemical Beast to add a Chemical Beast. And I'm totally not sure. I mean, I think I'll go ahead and send you and add you. Because you're like the boss-ass bitch monster. Then, uh, literally, we can just use our Spark Field. Banish you. Uh, is it Pop You or Banish You? I think it's Pop You. Yeah, I think it's Pop You to get rid of you. And of course, you'll go ahead and get your Monster Reborn effect, which is fine. Okay, you know, ask me if I give a shit, because then I could just special summon Malefic Stardust Dragon. So not only is Malefic Stardust Dragon protecting my field spell, allowing me a beater, but also, also, it is level 8. And we have some 8s in here. We have him, we have him, we have this. Trade him. You know, so, I, I, I'm, I mean, if I'm like the first Chemical Beast player to actually throw in Malefic Stardust, then, you know, I want to go ahead and uh, token that, coin that. And if not, and I'm fitting, yeah, and I'm totally wrong, you like, Daniel, yourself the fuck up, you don't know what you're doing, I've been doing fucking Malefic Stardust and Chemical Beast before the deck even came out, then, alright, I'll shut the fuck up. But from what I've seen in the research, I mean, I even looked up, you know, Lithium, he didn't even do it, so, mm. uh, I got a lot of influence from Lithium, you know, plays like that, we were, of course, running the Brilliant Fusion plays like that, because that's a pretty smart idea, too. They do Brilliant Fusion, summon, uh, I think it's Aqua, or, or Amethyst, Amethyst, well, well, Aqua type. And then send, uh, I think, Lappies, which will grab your normal monster back. So pretty much it's just a free search. Just brilliant things and send Lappies and do that. Grab it back. So I think that's pretty good. And right now, I mean, we got the play. Unless you, of course, draw her. Right? She's like, you you were talking about me, weren't you? <laughs> like, hello? So uh, I believe I could just keep on using my effect and keep getting searches, which would be pretty decent. Yeah? Pretty decent. So... I think I'll go ahead and use my spark field. Go ahead and have my crab get its effect again. You already know, crab, crab, he's the searcher. He is the searcher. So there's one where I think I can make the same level. I can special in the one for my hand. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and send a crab and I'm gonna grab me a ox because ox can, you know, do the shenanigans. And then once again, we'll go ahead and use my field. We'll pop your monster to get rid of my crab once again. And poke you with the Malefic Star Dash. And of course, you know, another thing about Malefic Star being eight is it's level eight, which means rank eight plays and this deck can do some rank eight plays. So I was kind of worried about this deck being kind of shitty, but we opened up pretty well and we've been going to town. So he played that Reckless, he couldn't draw for two turns and now he's in some deep shit. I, I hope it was worth it, you know? Yep, 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 GG. <laughs> All right, uh, I'll get to my story, bear back. All right, we're back. Uh, Chemical Beast love to go second, second. Cause I can't really can't do anything going first, you know? Yeah, I need a chemical beast. If I get a chemical beast in this hand, we can go. And we got a single memory. I already know. It's like, I don't like Doom Summon Gemini's. Ah, oh, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Oh, you're going to be seeing some Dark Lords, people. People like the Dark Lords. And play on Daily Duels. Probably going to go ahead and special summon that Christia. And I'm just going to be fucked. I'm like, all right. <laughs> oh, all right. Going to go ahead and start summoning that. Yeah, set that, set that. Card of Demise? No? Mm, mm, interesting. Uh, looks like he's running like a back row version, and overall, this hand's actually pretty decent. It's just, she can fuck me up because of this, but we might be okay. It really depends. Is this just a card in the field? Someone wants to run ahead. Strong card in the field. Yeah, that's a card. That sucks. That sucks. Well, I want everything except for this, so I think I'll go ahead and twin twister and pitch this. 
Valhalla, I would love to get rid of that too, but like I said, let's let's see what we can do. Because we're about to do our brilliant fusion plays. Like, I already know this deck, this deck. Uh, if you're wondering what, what happened to Dark Lights, I already changed it around to more of the Lithium version. Uh, that I actually recorded that before the new cards came out, before Lithium put up his video, which kind of just sucks. But uh, yeah. Uh, we're gonna try that version, low monster count, a lot of revival, all that shit, so we're gonna go ahead and send a Crab, we're gonna go ahead and send a Lazuli, and you already know, that play is pretty good, and Lazuli's gonna go ahead and go off and grab me back my Crab, so that, that was a Lithium play, I'm not gonna coin that, that was a Lithium play, and pretty good overall, really good, really good. So you're actually just gonna go ahead and use your effect now? Like, nigga, like, that's fine, like, <laughs> I didn't even need that, didn't even need that, like, you were like, oh, go ahead and get rid of that, like, Dude, that, <laughs> like, that wasn't even the extent of my plays. Like, if anything, you should have got rid of this. Like, it's fucking Sparkfield, boy. Like, you, you should have waited until something threatened you. Like, this wasn't even a threat. Like, this, this card wasn't even a threat. Like, literally, I just used that Berlin Fusion play to get the search. So good. Like, Lithium, smart, smart, smart. Uh, once again, we're going to go ahead and send... Uh, it's a level eight. I'm not sure how useful a level one, a level eight one is. That, that's the thing. I'm not sure how useful it is. I'm gonna go ahead and get dioxide. And now we pretty much got the play again. So that's that's pretty good. So once again, we'll go ahead and get rid of this. We'll pop her because I can't get over her with that fucking big old booty. And uh, that's gone. Then we could just special summon Malefic Stardust Dragon. So now you can't pop my field spell again if you wanted to. And now you're 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 kind of low on resources, son. You're kind of low. The sad thing is that you could easily just top that like a Christia and special summon because I didn't get rid of Valhalla. But I think the other shit was more important. You know, uh, Twin Twister, the Dark Lord deck is weak to Twin Twister. Like incredibly weak. It needs its back row. It needs its back row. It needs its revival to you know do the extent of its play. So when its back row and shit gets popped. It's pretty much it for this deck, and you know that's kind of sad to say. <laughs> so we'll go ahead and once again, normal summon, get my effect, and you already. I mean, I mean, it's kind of sucks that I'm literally just doing the same exact thing that I did last duel, but uh, overall not bad. So uh, once again, we'll go ahead and just send a chemical beast, add a chemical beast, and we're gonna go ahead and add that ox, add that ox. Uh, I'm not sure if we're actually gonna get that play set up, but <laughs> uh, of course I, I you know. Like Sardis can't attack. I might be able to end this duel right now, actually. It depends. Uh, let's see. If I use this effect, pop this set card. Oh, never mind. He's going to try. I was about to say, I'm going to use this card. It's about the set card. It might not be anything. Uh, I haven't used my normal summon. Like, I'm no, I've used my normal summon for fact, but I think I get an additional normal summon. Like, during your main phase, you can normal summon Jedi Monster, addition to normal summon, or set, which means I have a normal summon. I can normal summon uh, Dark Side, XC these two. Wait, no, no. I was thinking, I was thinking I can go into my XC Monster, but it has to be two Gemini Monsters. The two level eight Gemini Monsters, not just two level eight. I would say I can go to him, then detach, then summon him right back, and then go for a game, but nope. So, there we go. Go in that duel. All right, we'll get another one. Bear back. Oh, I'm even starting my story. My phone is freaking ringing. Where is my phone? I hear it. I dropped it on the floor. God damn it. Ugh. All right. Another duel. Bear back. All right. Back on another duel. Now I get the story started. So, uh, if you guys don't actually know, I'm still in college. Uh, despite it being summer break, uh, yeah, I'm still in college right now, which kind of sucks. It really does, you know, to be stuck here in college. I have a new class each month, so it's very, very, very fast. Uh, go ahead and send the materials. So. This, you know, are you the only Aqua? I don't think so. I think everybody's Aqua, isn't it? That's interesting. You might be the only Aqua. Hmm. Hmm. I guess we'll know when we go ahead and get that. I mean, I want to get the crab anyway, because I mean, it's the crab, but I would love to, you know, be able to send, like, my other Gemini monsters. Uh, that's interesting. Ah, uh, yeah, I thought I could send, I was thinking I could send Dioxide and grab Dioxide back and trade it in. But this hand's not too great. It really isn't. Uh... Vanishwater Present, it's a chemical beast monster you control, especially when different monsters from your deck. I think I'll go ahead and actually normal summon you and then set the burnout. I'm playing two burnout like Lithium because the card can be a little foggy. It's good, it's good. You know, I banish chemical beast to summon two chemical beasts from my deck, so, you know, no complaints there. But, uh, I guess we'll just go ahead and watch this guy fucking play with himself. Ah, uh, Raid Raptors. Ah, uh, Raid Raptors. Yep. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> Uh, it seems like I'm a lot of Raid Raptor players too. Like, Stack loves to sit there and touch himself. Pain Lanius. Alright. Uh, you're not going to get that off. Oh, wait. Never mind. Never mind. You are. 
That's fine. I was about to say you're not gonna get pain when you stop, but I say yeah, you're gonna pay with I was thinking of the one that uh the Xim one. Strix. Strike that. Strike that all on the floor, strike that, you're not searching no more. Strike that. alright, you get that to go ahead and get more searching. More searching! You can only use the effect of pain lenius once per turn, so or your normal summon type thing. That that might be the extent of your play. It's like I strike the shit out of you, boy. The sad thing is, if you bust out that fucking ultimate falcon, I mean, that's pretty much GG. Like, pretty much. <laughs> wow, the sad thing is, I don't think he can get over my fucking, uh... My carbon crab. Like, that's crazy! If he can't get over my carbon crab, like... Actually, you know, a carbon crab gets your search on. So, as you can go over see, the fill spell is very, very, very important. We're running triple fill spell, triple terraforming, and... You know, rip, we didn't get any, so... Damn, and then I catch that breakthrough skill too, boys. Like, all right, that's fine. Like, I just, I have no plays right now. I have no plays. I could do, I could do, uh, could do burnout. I might, I might just do burnout. I might just attack him, then burn out, then attack, attack. Like, like this sucks. Rip, rip. He breakthrough skilled me. Out of all the cards, he breakthrough skilled me. And you know what? Stopping that crab effect, catch crab effect just important. Anyway. Uh, with me being in college, this class, uh, you're probably wondering, like, oh, you're in class, you know, there's any cute girls? Hell no. Every, every single person, every single girl in there is ugly. Like, ugly. Ugly, ugly, ugly. Ooh. Ooh. Hell no. To the no, no, no. Alright, we're gonna summon you, and I think we're gonna summon the level 8, because we might be able to go into my boss monster, so. So, that would be pretty good. So, we'll go ahead and summon you. Get, take this 200 attack, boy! So I guess that's one reason to run this guy, but I'm just not sure how useful he is. Like he's bleh. this guy, yeah. This guy, no, you know. <laughs> so uh, we'll go ahead and actually go into. I could go. I mean, look at all these. Look at all these eights, dude. Like look at all these eights. Like I think I'm gonna go on this guy. Uh, let's go see when talking about my monster special summon it. Oh, it has to be in your graveyard, period. Oh, that sucks. I thought I detached the extreme material to summon back. Like, no. Like, oh. That sucks. Never mind. I was going to summon you and then detach and summon back. The problem has to exceed. Let's card exceed on your opponent to target for attacks. Target each of my monsters to use a card effect. And each of my monsters almost something to detach the material from this card. Make your opponent send one card from the hand. The graveyard, their choice. Uh, I mean. Uh. Shit. I think I might just go in and go into Lancelot or something. Or Felbrand. I can I can, I can, I can shut up. No, stop rushing me. Stop rushing me. Rushing me. Shit. Me. Thank you. <laughs> like nigga, uh, the, the bar rushes me. The bar is my judge, not you. I'm going to Felbrand. Like if you wanna say it out loud, I mean in your head, then that's fine. Oh shit, it's one twister. I'm going to probably get another search with the Ness. Yeah, I probably should have sent it to a twister. More mimicry. More searching. More mimicry. More fuzzy. More this. More that. More this. More that. Like, <sighs> that's the sad thing is that he's not doing anything. Like, he, like what has he done this entire duel? Nothing. Nothing. He's done nothing but search. Like, like rip, man. <laughs> All right. Go ahead and exceed those two into another four tricks. What? You're actually gonna attack? Oh, you wanna attack him. That's fine. He ain't doing shit. So. When this card is simple, return all set. Yeah, set. There's no set. So, that's fine. So, I see these two into force tricks. D ties to fuzzy. Get another search. Get another search. Like, search.deck. Search.deck. Resident Sleeper. Because that's the sad thing. He's not doing anything <laughs> he's just searching so detach okay he detached the the mimicry uh-huh banish to oh my god what search Woo! oh and then great fucking oh no he actually is one of them fuckers that plays readiness god damn it i hate when they play readiness like the deck can be much more aggressive and do much more play besides fucking searching and stalling with readiness i hate fucking readiness like holy shit i hate that card Ugh. You know, I don't want to do this duel anymore. I really don't. I really don't. Like, I'm already falling asleep. Mm-hmm. That's fine. Yep. So, breakthrough skill fucks me again. 
Awesome. And then readiness, like awesome. All right, can I draw into something? Do you stronger memories? It's not terrible. I think this guy has a pretty good effect. Once per turn, you can banish one giant monster from your graveyard or target one card your opponent controls and destroy it. It's actually pretty good. So, I believe he can just protect from destruction. So, so rip. <laughs> I don't know what I'm looking for. Effect, activate this effect, banish this, target this, pop it. I believe this, does this protect from battle or destruction? I can't remember. And then more search! More search, people, more search. So, you know what really sucks is that I'm gonna fucking lose this. I'm not gonna have much plays at all. Like, ugh, don't like this. Anyway, uh, the class sucks. I'm, I'm not a big fan of the class right now. I really, I'm really not. You're gonna go and take that? Well, you have to take it, actually, because. You can't activate this until this is in the graveyard, so. That's really all I got right now. Like, I'm running out of resources, I'm running out of plays while you, you just keep searching and searching and searching and searching and searching. Yep, skip force. Go ahead and pay half your fucking life points, cause you can. Like, alright. And then, go ahead and rank that up into satellite. Cannon, yep. Yep, they were was fucking twin twisters anyway. If anything, I would like to pop that nest. This, this, I'm not sure. So now I'm just top decking at this point. I'm not really sure what I'm going to top deck into, but I'm glad I faced search that deck. I'm glad that fucking this duel went so fantastically. Mm hmm. That's game. No, it's not. Is it? Yeah, that's game. That's game. Oh, wait, no. I can banish. <laughs> I, can, I can fucking burn out. Yeah, I can fucking burn out, boys. Ah, I should've took this. I should've took this. I didn't think that. I forgot that I summoned it from my banish down. I should've took this. Should've took this and then fucking let these two attack, but it's still, it's still the end result, because at least I could've kept my monster. So I'm not dead. I'm not dead. I would've been dead. I would've been dead if it wasn't for burnout. So, yay, burnout. Save back at it again with saving my ass. I don't know what I'm gonna draw, probably into nothing. It's probably gonna turn these two into another force tricks or something. What? what? Summon back force tricks again. Like, okay. Exceed these two into another force tricks, and then he's touching it another search, and another search, and another search, and another search, and another search. I don't like Grey Raptors. <laughs> I just wanted to go ahead and state that. I, I don't I don't like Grey Raptors. Not at all. Not fucking at all. Yay, more search. Totally don't have enough search. Let me draw like another Swing of Memories or something. Like, that would be great. Draw into another Swing of Memories and just attack this for game. What did he get? Did he get another fucking readiness? Oh, he was vanishing. Nah, I didn't draw anything. Alright, oh, you got it. Oh, you got it. But, I need to start on the story. Like, hello? Be right back. At this point, I'm probably gonna put Rave Raptors on the list of decks that I'm just not gonna duel anymore, because. I'm just sick and tired of sitting, and watch, sitting here watching them play with themselves. You know? It gets boring. <laughs> it really does. Uh, oh my god. Fucking. No. I'm not gonna fucking face Tree Toad. Like, come on. Bring it back. No. I actually want to duel. Anyway. Well, the reason why it's called Midnight is because we have this assignment. The assignment was due on the 21st, right? It's a discussion post. You have to post a discussion. You have to post some part of the discussion. Now don't open up nearly as well. That opening hand was kind of okay. You know, I got my fill spell at least. You know, and you can never complain about getting your fill spell. Oh, now this guy's gonna just try to stall me out. Like, hello? Like, nigga, I don't, I don't even care. I don't even fucking care. Like, I'll poke you the shit out of you with crab, boy. Like, crab is the boss ass bitch. You, you ain't ready. You ain't ready. Wow, rip, fucking rip. Curse seal the fucking forbidden spell, people. So now I can't activate Trident anymore. And that's gone. That sucks. That kind of sucks. All right, I'm a twin twister. I'm gonna pitch this one in memories and pop your other two set cards. Wow, another curse seal. Magic drain. Damn. Damn. Wow. This motherfucker. This motherfucker. He's like, nah, man. I'm playing back row that deck. I'm fucking playing fucking messenger of peace. Fucking curse seal for Ben Spouse. Just talking with that card and fake card Friday today. Rip. Anyway. Uh, go ahead. Did I make my phone? Yeah, I made my phone good. Discussion. You have to post a discussion and then reply to two people by the 21st. Wow, I need to surrender. It's like, you stop all my plays and you need to surrender. Like, all right, all right. Fucking bear back. Uh, he stopped both my plays. Those are some great-ass plays, too. Great ass plays. And then you just quit. Because like, you already know. I was going to start warning whatever you were going to try to do and then fucking start going off with crap. Like, let's go, boys. 
Uh, are you an aqua? No, you're a fiend. You're a beast. So, so yeah, it literally just searches for crap. Like, that, that's understandable. This is that it just searches for crap. But crap is like one of the best, so you already know that you want to search for crap. Once again, he made me go first, which sucks. It sucks, big monkey balls. Like I don't, I don't want to go first. Like this deck doesn't like to go first. I want to go second, so I can do all my plays. Like what the fuck am I doing if I'm going first? You know. Oh, I summoned the wrong one. God damn it! I summoned the fucking wrong monster. Yep, rip, rip. I meant to summon crab. I need to put some rank 2 Xyz in here too. God damn it. Ugh. God damn it. God damn it. So what do you do? You're in main pitch, someone jam my monster from your hand if you do level one. Uh, uh, I mean, I guess that's okay. I still have a play, but god damn it, I didn't want to do that. Like, oh, you become eight, so. At least not deep shit, you know? But that, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to summon crap. <laughs> I wanted to summon crap. Yeah, anyway, uh, so I did my discussion post. I did my post. The, the post we're doing on the 21st. I did my post, I think, on the 18th. And literally, my post was the only post. Both of them. There's two of them. My post is the only post until, like, the 20th. So, someone, one other person posts. I replied to them. But you need two replies. Two replies. I was sitting there waiting all the 21st for someone to do a post so I could fucking reply to their post to complete my assignment. I shit you not, I stayed up all the way until midnight, fucking 21st, going to the 22nd. One person literally posted at 12 o'clock. Like, nigga, you know that I can't do my assignment until you guys do your assignments, fuck boys. Like, and you know what? They may be the goody goodies. Like, on Thursday, they actually go to class. And it's not mandatory to go to class. They go to class. I don't. But at least I get all my fucking work done. Like, y'all, y'all niggas, y'all niggas fucking be driving me crazy with that shit. Like... <laughs> I wish I could do something more with Amethyst. Like, I wish Amethyst was eight. If Amethyst was eight, like, yeah, buddy. Like, yeah, I wish, I wish. Facing them DDDs and top tier DDDs in OCG, that's pretty good. It really is, really is. It's not my favorite cup of tea because it's just so convoluted and so combo heavy that I fuck it up. Like, it's been on daily levels, I think, two months, two months in a row, so. Like, did you not open up that well? Like, I'm actually surprised what you're doing right now. Like, I'm, it's a lot of set cards for DDDs. <laughs> it's a lot of set cards for DVDs. So, start doing our crab plays. And grab a normal summon for my effect. I think I'll go ahead and actually get rid of uh, your gate. Because I don't want you to keep searching and searching and searching and searching every time. You know, that's not something I want to, to happen. You want to use some of your back row? Like, I, I just don't see DVDs setting that much. Needlebug's Nest. Milling and DVDs. Yeah, I was about to say interesting, but I can't even say that. Like, I, I, I don't think I like that. I, I, don't, I don't think I like that. Like, milling and DDDs? Like, I mean, I guess. Like, I could see it, but, like, what did you mill? Like, no, no, no. Maybe that could, depending on if you have, like, buffer mine. And then, no, like, like I, I, I don't like, like any of that. <laughs> I could attack with the crab, but I think I'll just go ahead and... Like, mmm. Let's say, are you not a good DDD player? It's gonna go ahead and tax. I know that you're playing like mirror forces and shit. Magical cylinder. Ah, you can have that. That's not what I'm mad at. Like, I guess you're playing some weird DDD burn deck? Okay. So, you do that, then you do that. I think I have to be on the field with all my effects, so I guess I'll go ahead and now chain it. You're gonna play both of them. Fuck it. You know? So. If it was just Magic Cylinder, sure, you can have that down in mat. But then you're gonna play Sandstorm too? Like, no. Like, now I'm unaffected, and now I'm unaffected on both the cards. Like, good job, good job, good job. Rip. <laughs> mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. This might be one of the worst DDD players I've ever faced, but, I mean, he is using DDD, so maybe he'll be able to pull some great shit off. I don't know. He still has some plays. He has fucking Ragnarok in his hand. You know, Ragnarok is the shit. <laughs> Wow, he has another one? All right. All the bad people get the good shit. <laughs> another one. Like, all right, all right. I wonder if he top decked that. I might watch the replay just to see if he top decked that or he just opened up with two. I mean, the fucking, the fucking odds of getting this card are really high. Like, you have three of these, three Kepler, one for one. You have, you have a lot of fucking ways again. Did you just add another fucking Ragnarok? All right. 
So you're actually gonna pendulum summon? Yeah, looks like it. Yep, pendulum summon. Two Ragnaroks, I guess. Yep, two Ragnaroks. Get that effect, get that effect. Like, I think I might just stop you. Yeah. yeah. Just gonna stop you. I negated the wrong one. Fuck me! Fuck me! I didn't even see it! Like, it went back- Oh, wow. 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 Well, I guess they could both activate. Never mind. What? Like, wow. Fuck me. Fuck me. I negated the wrong one. Good job, Daniel. Good job. Rip. Uh, I can't believe I negated the wrong fucking one. <laughs> I thought he activated the one in attack position. Like, it was just like, whoop! Activate. Like, but you can't attack. Not that this card matters. Like, it already served its purpose. You have no set card. If you kill it, it's just dead. Ah, uh, fuck me. I can't believe I fucking did that. <laughs> uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and, once again, use my normal summon to gain my effect. I think I might go ahead and crack his... I was thinking about maybe cracking his pinging skill, but I'm not sure. I'm going to go ahead and send my 8 because, of course, I have some memories, so that's good. And uh, then I can go ahead and grab me... Uh, you, you discard one card and target one. Uh, I think I want to do Ox. No. no. Uh, we'll get Hawk. I could just normal summon this. I haven't normal summoned yet. So, I think I want to get rid of this. Let me crack the scales with this. I'm trying to, trying to figure out, do I run Dark Matter in here? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Cool. Cool. So, I think I'll go ahead and do that play. I think I'll go into, like, uh, Cypher and shit. <laughs> Alright, so, go ahead and once again, activate this, get rid of this, of this. Then I still haven't normal summoned, so then I can normal summon this. So the memories, and this. Then I can go ahead and go into Cypher. Uh, there's really no point in me taking your monsters. I'd rather kill them and then go to the extra deck. So, yeah, we'll go into Cypher. What are your pendulum effects? Uh, you cannot punch someone for duty monsters or it's hard. War is only effect with trap, then flick then to use charges card. And what do you do? Once a turn, you can target one D trap card. One card to target one spell or trap card on it. Build, and one other D card to destroy them. So, yeah, I'm gonna get rid of you. I'm gonna get rid of you. Uh, there's no point in doing that, so we'll just go ahead and go into a full armor. We got that Cypher Blight, but uh, I actually want to go into a full armor so I can attack both of these guys after I crack his pendulum scale. So I'll go ahead and go into you, crack this, and now go into Dark Matter. He won't have any dragons to send, but I can use Dark Matter's effect, detach to attack everyone, everyone. Like, not bad. <laughs> Attack you, and attack you. So even despite my fuck up, I'm still okay. So, uh, someone literally posted a total con. So, I as soon as I refreshed the plate and I saw it, they posted it, I replied to them, put disclaimers like, sorry that, that my assignment is late to reply because it was due on the 21st, but now it's the 22nd that fucking, you know. I don't think my teacher is going to be that anal, but, you know, the, 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 the fact of the matter is, is that I couldn't do my shit because they didn't do their shit. It's like, wow, like... Y'all are fucking procrastinating like mother procrastinating like motherfuckers. Like, all right. Once again, looks like I'm gonna win this duel, so that's good. And then we'll go ahead and call it a video. You know, gotta render and upload this. I got other shit to do today. Uh, got Monster Hunter. I got. I got. I gotta get back. I'm sorry. I gotta. Get, I gotta get back to Monster Hunter. Uh, we'll send the crab because we don't need any more. I'll go ahead and grab the ox. Like, this card's kind of eh. Like it really is. Like this card, kind of eh. Like if these two are combined. I kind of feel like this card's a little bit better than this one. I think it is. I think I ran three of this and two of this like Lithium was. Because this card, I may revive, but they're not the same level. Why this? I was thinking you'd probably put like a two or a one in here. Like, but everybody, everybody's good. Like, I'm really, I'm really mostly just doing rank eight plays. Like, really? Uh, but once again, go ahead and activate Sparkfield. Pop this set card, because it's probably like a Mirror Force or something. It is a Mirror Force rip. Uh, and uh, does anybody have any attack? You have some attack. 
summon you, attack, attack, yeah. But that's it, I wouldn't shoot you. Uh, probably one of the worst DVD players I've seen in a cool minute. Like, and even I'm bad, because I fucked up. Like, I'd, I'd be misplaying. <laughs> Every day I'd be misplaying, misclicking, can't take shit back. Like, mm. <laughs> Alright, so we're done. So, hopefully, we got two more discussion posts. So, hopefully they actually get on the ball this time, or... You know, I don't think the teacher's gonna be that anal and it's gonna be like, oh, Daniel, you had the assignment was due on the 21st and you posted the 22nd at fucking 12.05 a.m. in the morning, so, you know, no. But, you know, fuck me nonetheless, right? <laughs> anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed the sort of daily duel. So, overall, not bad. That was pretty fun. You know, it's kind of bad mouthing Kevin Kubrick saying it's not good, but, you know, if you get the right plays, you pull out, you, you can pull out some good plays. You really can. So, I'm not sure if what I'll tweak in the deck, if anything, I might just come back. If you guys have any suggestions, go ahead and tell me in the comment section below. At this point, I don't even care. I was going to say the replay and see if he fucking, but it doesn't matter. Like, I beat his ass, so he didn't do any damage to me. DDs, for goodness sakes. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all support. Uh, deck profile for the Crystal Beast Pendulum, if you haven't seen it already. If you have, then thank you. Uh, and we're at this dumb deck profile. The new lineup for Daily Duels is now up from... Uh, July through August, so uh, this is what we'll be having for the next month, involving and changing uh, the decks as we progress, and then we'll see uh, more content as uh, time goes by. So, did you guys enjoy? Thanks for watching, thanks for the support, and uh, I will see you guys next week with some more daily duels. Thanks for watching.